Hey, this is John the Anti-Marketer, just shooting this quick how-to video on how you can easily update your favicon uh, icon on your website. And so um, I'm going to be shooting a bunch of these because there's so many little things that can just make you look really cool in your online presence. It might not add to, to the bottom line, but it adds to your brand and, and that can't help but add to your bottom line. So uh, what a favicon is, is, is this little icon here. And you can have your initials, you can have your logo. And so this is this is my wife's site and I'm giving a free plug to it. Um, you should check it out, it's a really good site. Um, but you'll notice here the brand is the butterfly and, and we've put that up here in the tab that opens. So any of her pages will open up with this branding and it's just something small, but it does make a big difference. So I'm gonna show you how you can update this. So I've got a new site I'm, I'm playing with at the moment. Uh, it's a bit of a test site for me, and I've been developing it, um, the dronebuyersguide.com. So um, what I want to do is I want to update this thing. So just quite easily, I, I, I don't believe I, I want to pay for anything uh, for that reason. You know, I'm not going to get a graphic designed, but I just went and typed in icon drone free, and, and I downloaded this icon here. So here it is here. Um, if I was to open it in my drawing package, I think the width was like 250 um, by 250. There it is there. What I've done, I've shrunken it down to 50 by 50. Um, and just so you can see the size here is dramatically reduced to 4K. Uh, and, and so that just means whenever anyone opens a tab, it doesn't, it just um, helps with the load on the site. Shouldn't make a difference to the quality, but let's let's give it a go. So. What you want to do is you want to log in to your WordPress site. Um, and I'm already here, but I'll just uh, come back. Uh, I'm going to log into my WordPress site. There's my dashboard. I just want to go to Appearance, Customize. Um, and so with Customize, you've got a lot of things that you can do. Uh, I'm just coming to my site identity. And here it is here, the site, site icon. So if I click on Select Icon, um, I can come over here and drag across my little fellow there. Um, and we'll just have a look and see what, what it looks like. I'm going to select it. Um, and okay, it's going to say image cropping. Um, looks like it appears okay. Skip cropping. And there we go. Um, and then publish. There it is. So all I do here is I'll just open up. I always like to open up an incognito window when I'm testing just to make sure everything works fine. Um, let's have a look there. There's my drone. So you'll notice here on a black incognito window, it doesn't appear very well. Um, let's try it on a normal browser because it's black. Um, and I, I, I'm going to just select the black because I think that stands out. So that's cool. That's, that's as easy as you get it. So if you like this training, if you want to hear some more training, some easy how-to stuff just to make your site sing and dance, uh, subscribe to this channel. Uh, visit the website, antimarketer.com. Uh, subscribe to my list. Uh, and I send stuff like this out all the time. I hope you enjoy.